When it comes to the particular ancient Uparts that we share, which have a simply impossible age, this, in regard to the modern chronological paradigm of man's historical origins, in which man evolved from the sea to the cave and then into modern civilization, in a supposedly already mapped out and fully understood linear fashion with no gaps whatsoever. A position made to attain undeserved authority over historical teachings. Thus, when an object turns up which contests these so-called already established factual ideologies, it is either simply dismissed or those who oppose such possibilities of its existence go to great length to discredit its authenticity in any way. Furthermore, it must be mentioned that many more than could be contributed to coincidence have mysteriously disappeared over the years, scenarios, and events, which simply strengthen the original claims of the object's authenticity. Our next artifact of interest being no exception. Known as the Meister print, it is an artifact that many have attempted to discredit as an authentic human footprint for good reason. And when one recites the academic opposed theory regarding the dismissal of said hypothesis of human origin, it exposes how miserably said attempt was. It is simply written off as a portion of Jurassic strata, at which at some point in the distant past, naturally fractured, coincidentally, into the form of a human-shaped shoe print. However, this explanation, or attempted dismissal, avoids any attempt to explain away the main feature within the print, which not only proves it was indeed a print, once made by induced pressure onto this ancient earth, but why it's claimed as an upart in the first place. Within the print, there exists a crushed trilobite, which proves this was indeed a pressed print, but also confirms an age of hundreds of millions of years. Thus, whatever made this print had a human-shaped foot, was seemingly wearing shoes or boots, and was heavy enough to crush an ancient arthropod. These facts, along with academia's miserable attempt to dismiss said upart, we therefore find highly compelling.